newly modernized. Um, oh gosh, I, oh, yeah. my video just started. All right, this is a newly, <laughs> newly modernized Otis elevator, modernized by possibly. All right, it was modernized by PEI. It's a local elevator company. I thought that was Kone. Well, up well, plastic level. They just have Kone sensors, or not Kone sensors, but Kone stickers. I'm with I was Firelight 219. Yeah, I'm filming this with the TX1 just because I don't really feel like using the TX100V. Innovation Universal fixtures. It I don't believe it has the same controller unless it somehow got the uh, relays to translate into some feature that the indicator. Yeah, still keep the security barcode using a mass and cat. I haven't used the TX1 in a long time, so I have to get used to it again. That yeah. Otis door is like a cell nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's it might, it, that probably is something that has the same controller. I'm not sure. All right, let's watch the classic level. Uh, yeah. Oh, I missed it. So, capacity, capacity is surprisingly 5,000 pounds. It's actually more than the freight, I think. Yeah. Or the freights. Yeah, all three of them. They're all sort of the same elevator. Yeah, bungee jumping. We have some. They always, always have something there. Yeah. Whether it be the same as Wonderland, sure. Easter Bunny, or Bungee. Bungee's there. A lot of fountains, sure. a lot of coins in them. Mm -hmm. And we'll go back up to UM. We'll get our cat view. Yep. Again, it's okay if you film me, but I'm, I, yeah. I just don't want to film you. Mm -hmm. um. The cab is much, much, much improved. It smells like hydraulic fluid. This thing was low in oil. The guy, the technician showed me when they were like done modernizing this on the last day of the mod. Um, he showed me down into the pit. And there was oil everywhere. As in the machine room that was on the first floor right outside of the elevator in the ground. 